Hello everybody, welcome back to Final Fantasy. Um, we're gonna fight an optional boss before we do the good stuff, but I need to find a Moogle first. And I think there's a Moogle up here and to the right. Here's hoping we don't have any of the frame rate destruction from last time, because that was scary. That made me want to cry. Frame rate? More like frame rate. <laughs> And we're going to save because I haven't saved in a while and that could be bad. Yeah. yeah, it's only like an hour later from my last save. Look at that. <laughs> I, I would only have to replay an hour of the game. Alright, so we're going to check on equipment. Alright, so we're going to use a tent, and then we're going to go fight us an optional boss. Yay! Yay! Alright, let's do this thing. Hopefully, um, now you weren't part of the recordings yet by the, when, I, when I fought him the first time. Um, but uh, when I fought him the first time, I was severely under-leveled for it, and I was on a timer, so I was kind of stressed out. Wah, wah, wah. Alright, so here he is. There's the boss right there. That that book up there. <laughs> Hi, boss. How do I... Oh, there we go. I hear someone talking. Try to listen. Challenge me if you dare. dare. <laughs> I don't like that it doesn't play the boss music. It is definitely a boss. And the other optional boss plays the boss music, but whatever. Wow. I told you! It was a book! Doom! <laughs> yeah, I know. That's that's the bullshitty part here. Um So, the way this works, you do not want anybody to be you do not want to have anybody attacking in multiplicity. Nope, not in there. So let's attack him. You want to you want to attack one at a time in case he pops out. Nope. I did not mean to attack with VB. You're not supposed to attack with VB. Uh, I'm gonna do raise wind. Ta-da! He's so adorable. Why did he just... Oh, right, Doom. <laughs> I was like, why did he die? <laughs> Alright, so here's the thing. You do not want to attack him with a physical attack. Just magic. If you attack him with a physical attack, he will immediately run back into the book. Yep. So now we just use the magic on him, and we just hope we do enough damage. Um, I wonder if throwing something counts? I'm afraid to throw something to him, and then he, like, just jumps ship on me because of it. Ooh, let's steal from him. Let's see if we can get stolen ether. Hopefully. Uh, let's try Thunjar. I need to figure out what element does the most damage to him. 
Amarin's about to die again. Yep, there he goes. Uh, Thundara doesn't do much either. Um. Ooh! Oh, it says deals physical damage. That's technically a spell, but I'm not sure if it would come across as a spell, because it says it deals physical damage. Well, I want to see how much thievery's doing now. So I guess I gotta try it, and let's just hope he doesn't run back into the book. Here's hoping he doesn't run back in the book, and here's hoping I've stolen enough for it to actually do some damage. Alright, what do we got? What kind of damage are we doing? If I've stolen enough, it would automatically do... Holy crap! Awesome! Alright, good. That means I've been stealing enough. We are definitely not done. I have definitely... Okay, so fire is our answer. Gotcha. Alright, he has not run back into the book yet. I'm just gonna, like, go crazy on him because I think he might run away now. So I'm just gonna go crazy. Just start using everything. As long as my turn comes before his. What the fuck? Why does he keep dying? What is going on? Why can't I keep him alive? No, he doesn't have the thing with the blood sword thing going on. Plus, this is a demon type. It's not even... Alright, so we are doing plenty of damage. We might actually win this before he can run away. That'd be awesome. That'd be very good to get, get him before he can run away. Because I... His, his sandstorm ability fucking sucks. It, it gives everyone darkness, hurts them bad, it's not great. Come to hit you with books again. Just eat an elixir, Ameren, so you'll stop fucking dying. God damn. Like, we, we have to have done a fuck ton of damage by now. Like, this has got to be adding up. I've got to be getting close. Oh, he went back in the book. Shit. Alright, tag him. Alright, so... We need an ether. Get your MP back. She's gonna do her healing thing. I wish I had Queena. Let him hit. Nothing on that page. He's almost dead. I know he has to be almost dead. Because, like, I, we just we just did so much damage to him. He's got to be getting close. Uh, well, Freya's trancing. I don't know if that's really gonna help. I can try using her good trance ability. See if it actually does anything. Yeah. Um, you know what? I wonder. Because his thievery skill is supposed to bypass defense, I wonder if it'll do the damage even when he's hidden. Be interesting. Amaranth, if you don't stop dying, you motherfucking ginger, just... God damn it. I'm used to him being much more helpful. It does the damage anyway! Oh, dude, book, you're so fucked. So, I was right. It bypasses defense entirely. That is awesome. You are fucked. Hubbernucked. I don't care if he doesn't pop out, he's gonna die anyway. <laughs> he's shitting essays on me, he needs to stop. And now Zidane's gonna trance, and that's a waste of a trance. Oh well. 
thievery! Because fuck you! Yeah. It'd be cool if it like summoned a mimic and it like ate the monster. Oh, come yeah, on. Not lucky. <laughs> no. Page 104, nothing on this page. You know what? I just had a thought. I wonder if the damage you do here does not count towards his HP, no matter how high it is. Possibly. I don't have a way to really check his HP right now. Hammer, please stay alive. You motherfucker. Nope, as soon as I get him alive again. Oh my goodness. You're pissing me off. In the sky. Her, uh, her trance thing, she leaps into the air and just rains spears. Okay. Like this. Come on, get out of the fucking book. No. He needs to get out of the fucking book. Pissing me off. There he is. Here we go. I'm gonna use I'm gonna use one of these. I don't have enough to use in to use my bigger ones. So we use that one. And you can revive Amrit for the 40th fucking time. Because I need him to get the points out of this. He's one of the things. 5,000 damage and he died. And, well, Amrit gets no points. Oh well, poor Amrit. Sucks to suck. Lancer, MP tag, everyone's learning shit. Look at that. Except for Amaranth, who would have benefited! <laughs> Motherfucker can't stay alive! Got some running shoes. You are worthy. Wait, was I supposed to steal that thing? He was supposed to give me a certain item. Was I supposed to steal that? Oh, I'm so mad. I'm gonna be so mad if I was supposed to steal it and I just, like, fucked out on it. Which means then we'd have to go back and play it again. No. He doesn't have it. Oh, we're out of time. Look at that. Perfect timing. Perfect timing. So, okay, I think in this version of it, he doesn't have it. He had a special item in the original. Good for him. However... Oh, well. Yep. But that was fun. So that was the second shot I took at that guy, and I didn't die this time. Hey, we should revive Asshat. Once we get access to the world map again, I'm going to have to do some grinding. And I'm going to be overleveled again because I want everyone to learn all the abilities, but fuck it. <laughs> the tent is cute. Um, I love that it's like, our town's being destroyed by a dragon and a warship. Let's take a nap in a tent. Because point. Nap time. Hey, I'm, I, I have a thousand more than I started with at the auction house. Yeah. Yep. Alright, so that's it for this episode. Uh, we killed the Tantarian... Tantarian? Hold on. How do you say this? Tantarian. Yeah. The I'm gonna say the cutest optional boss I've ever seen. Um, uh, next time we're gonna go up the castle and we're gonna go see what's going on up top with Garnet and Ico. Until then, be good. Bye-bye. Bye, guys. Bye.